Welcome back to Mika Luna's Dolls and more. I appreciate you guys being here. Today I'm going to be sharing with you this huge, huge haul that I've gotten right in front of you from a lot of the clearance aisles at local Walmarts and Target stores. I can't believe I got this Ralph Breaks the Internet playset for only $22.41. I know it's only you only save about $7.50, but that's major because I love this set. I love Pocahontas and I love Ariel and I'm so so excited that I got it. I guess the reason why it was probably in clearance is because the box is sort of damaged on the side. But I love all the accessories it comes with and um, the only bad thing is Ariel has no shoes. At first I thought maybe that's how the maybe that's why it was in clearance, but then after looking at other videos of unboxings, I see that Ariel actually does not have the shoes. So that's fine. In the back of the box, of course, you have every other character that you could also get in this places. I also got this Marvel Rising Secret Warriors at my local Target for $9. And I'm not too familiar with this character, but it says it's Doreen Green, Squirrel Girl. So I was so excited because she is a curvy doll and she's articulated and she has some awesome, awesome accessories and I love the squirrel that she comes with. In the back of the box you have a little bit more information about this character as well as in the bottom you have additional characters that also come in sets which I have not seen. Next up, yes I know, we have this Boxy Girls um, box with two full limited edition dolls included inside. I have not collected any Boxy Girls. So I'm so excited because I only got this for $10 and I thought it was well worth the money to get it for $10 and add two boxy girls to my collection. So the boxes, um, you can unbox 33 plus surprises, um, you handle with care and up this way. So I'm so excited that I have this in my collection and maybe later on I'll do a video. Um, I know they've been around for a while so I don't know if you guys are interested in seeing that. Guys, and I cannot believe I found JC Masters from Wild Hearts Crew on clearance for $7. It could be that my Walmarts actually had JC Masters like crazy everywhere for a while there. So it could be that they have a lot of overstock, so that's the reason why they put them on clearance. Hopefully, we'll be doing a giveaway in the future and we'll be giving one away um, to you guys. I know that Canada still probably doesn't have them yet, so. Um, I definitely want to share with you guys my excitement for this brand new Wild Hearts Crew collection. Also guys, I was able to find Cory, and I'm so glad that I finally added her to my collection, which is awesome. And I don't know if I'll be doing an unboxing, but maybe I'll include it in my Instagram. So go check out my Instagram since I post things in there about new things being released and clearance items and stuff like that because I only upload YouTube videos weekly or so. I found these two Barbie sets for only $9 on clearance aisle, of course. So let's take a quick look at this one first. And this one I originally did an unboxing a few months back or weeks back. And it's so adorable because it's a Barbie desk with a Barbie. And I, since I already have this in my collection, I think I might just do a giveaway for this one too. So $9 is an awesome price for this because I think they're about $20. And and then this other one I really wanted to collect for a while. Um, I just decided to go with this one first, um, the one that I did the unboxing for. But I was so, so excited to be able to find this one for $9 also because it actually has like a bed on top. And then it's also a desk which you can flip over and it converts to like a bunk bed sort of way. So I'm so excited and I think this Barbie is gorgeous too. In the back of the box it kind of has the instructions of how to convert it to a bunk bed and additional places that you can find down in the bottom. So I really want to get this beauty or spa set too, but I haven't been able to find it in clearance yet. That's what I'm waiting for, the clearance. I also found a lot of Chelsea Barbies. Um, I found this three cute little mermaid ones from Barbie's Dreamtopia. They were really in clearance for $1.50. I know they're marked $3, but I actually got them for $1.50, which I thought it was an awesome deal. Anyways, I haven't seen this purple one and this pink hair one in clearance at all. I've seen a lot of the orange hair mermaid ones in clearance, but not this one. And they're just so, so adorable. I just couldn't help myself. I really love this purple hair Chelsea Mermaid. I also found this outfit at my local Target for $3.48, which I've already done an unboxing on this outfit, but I just thought it was pretty cool how it was in clearance for $3.48. I was also able to find this Club Chelsea's mini golf playset, which I'm so excited because it was only $7, originally about $14.88. Um, so exciting because they are so expensive. Every Club Chelsea playset is so expensive. I also got the Treehouse uh, playset at clearance 
Um, I already had the little train, so I think this is the last set that I needed. And what I'm most excited about is this adorable beekeeper playset, which I'm so, so excited because actually she was on sale and I got her for $9, the one with the African-American doll or Nikki. The set comes with bees, honey, a little beekeeper um, thing and some flowers down below so it's just so so adorable and I'm so excited to finally be able to have her in my collection. I love her outfit and her little hat with the little net around her face. So cool. I think for $9 this was a steal and I definitely got me more than one playset. On the back of the box it just has a little bit more information and how to play with the beekeeper set. I also scored me two Harry Potter dolls, which I'm so excited about. I got McGonagall and Draco. They were originally, I think, like clearance to $9 and then they bumped it down to $5, which is so, so exciting. I wish I could find Harry Potter, but I just never really see Harry Potter like go on sale at all. It's always the other characters, but so excited because they were only $5 and that's really cool. Next up, I have a few of the farm related or sweet orchid farm um, dolls, which I'm so excited about because I found them on clearance. First up, let's go ahead and review the two candles. Um, I got the African American Sweet Orchid Farm for, I believe, $3.50, and I got the regular can for $5. So that's really a good price. I was so excited to find the African American doll for $3.50, honestly, because I've seen most of the can dolls go on sale for about $5, but that is so, so, so cool. Next up is this really adorable chicken farmer set that I've been wanting for a while so I was so excited to find it at clearance at my local Target for $13.98. Um, the original price was $19.99. I believe in Walmart it was maybe a little bit cheaper. Um, can't really recall what the price is that I've seen it for but I was so excited because I've never had anything like like this before so I, I really wanted the chickens and the chicken coop with the eggs and the little chicks this place that is absolutely adorable I also love what she's wearing I love her that her shirt says live love farm she's wearing a pair of shorts and she's wearing really adorable boots too that you can't see I also found me the farmer and tractor which is definitely one of my favorite finds I found it for $15 and originally it's $30 so I guess about half off um, I'm so excited because this one has a little goat it has some chicks uh, um, it has a chicken and the little cow with the little heart on its forehead really cute and it has their little red tractor that is so so awesome so I'm so excited about that and at this price um, you can't really beat it I was also so so excited to find some fresh dolls at one of the local Walmart so I wouldn't say it's too local it's kind of farther away but um, it's you know it's something that I've been looking forward to buying for a long long time I know that you can only purchase them through their website and then select Walmart have them so I found them in clearance five dollars each guys only five dollars i know that they go for about thirty dollars on the website and then i believe walmart had them originally priced about 24.99 or something like that and the reason i know that is because i actually ended up buying some of the um places over at the original price that weren't on clearance but these two were actually in clearance for five dollars and it was so so exciting to find them if you want me to do an unboxing on this specific or any other items that i, I had in this haul let me know in the poll up here and i'll be sure to do that in my next video um as always guys thank you so much for watching i hope you guys are all having a wonderful wonderful day and thank you so so much for 400 subscribers i couldn't be more excited i will have some giveaways coming up soon and as always take care love you adios